The officials are ready. The fighters are in the ring. And they are ready. So for the thousands in attendance and the millions watching around the world, ladies and gentlemen, uh, let's get ready to rumble! The super lightweight division is jam-packed with incredibly talented fighters. Regis Progre is recognized and respected champion. Tifema Lopez has proven that he can both box and brawl with the best of them. And Devin Haney, the division's newest face, has pound-for-pound -pound worthy skills. Sobriel Matias, however, seems to possess something different. The 31-year-old Puerto Rican punishes his opponents, often beating them so badly that mandatory visits to the nearest emergency room is needed. Recently, that trend continued. Richardson Hitchens itched closer to his television screen as Matias continued his onslaught. The Brooklyn native wasn't surprised by what was taking place, but the violent manner in which Matias went about his business was jaw-dropping. At the age of 26, Hitchens is hoping to one day grab his own world title and begin his reign of dominance. Lately, he's prioritized matchups against Lopez, Haney, and Matias, on the other hand, hasn't been on his radar. Hitchens' reluctance to mention Matias as a possible future opponent doesn't stem from some overarching fear to take on a harder puncher. The IBF recently ordered Hitchens to face Jack Catterall in a final eliminator. Unlike the rest of the sanctioning bodies, the IBF forces both its champion and challengers to not only make weight a day prior, but also stay within 10 pound rehydration the next morning. That factor makes Hitchens hesitant. Facing someone whose sole mission is to put his opponents on a stretcher comes with obvious dangers. Still, after schooling Jose Cepeda just a few short months ago, Hitchens is confident that he can handle whatever Matias is dishing out of the ring. Open quote, if I fight a guy like Matias, I will want to be at 100%, Hitchens told BoxingScene.com. I wouldn't want to fight him in the IBF where there's a rehydration demand. I'm not a small 140, I'm a big 140. I will want to come in there and be at my best. That's a big challenge. I'm not gonna act like it's not a huge challenge, so I would want to be at my best, but I would fight him, close quote. Guys, how do you think a fight between Richardson Hitchens and Subaru Matias would look? Uh, you know, we're excited to see how Richardson Hitchens fares against Jack Catterall. We know Jack Catterall is a hungry fighter. Uh, he's been in there with champion Cordina. So um, let's see how let's see let's see how this goes. Um, it's been ordered, and uh, it's if there's no agreement, it's going to go to a purse bid. Matchroom is going to win, and um, we're going to get it probably sometime in February. I would I would assume maybe January, late Jan. No, probably February, maybe even March. So guys, let us know in the comments below what are your thoughts. Uh, do you think that Richardson Hitchens is going to take it or? Do you think that Jack Catterall is going to take it? What do you think about a fight between Hitchens and Subaru Matias? Let us know in the comments below. You can find us on Instagram at Sportbox TV official, X formerly known as Twitter at Sportbox TV. And of course, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and also share the vid. We appreciate all love and support. Take care.